title of this writing is Solution Pollution. The grasshopper came up with this definition one day. Justifications. Telltale signs that you're not working on the solution. Justifications either move you backwards or keep you in place. They rarely lead to forward progress. When we're busy justifying, we take all of our time looking for a scapegoat or a support group to agree with us instead of taking that opportunity to seek a solution. Solutions can occupy the same space as justifications. Justifications and solutions mix even less than oil and water. I saw a football player's apology online one day. It started with an explanation, a justification of why he did what he did. There is no room in an apology for a justification. It keeps the bad blood in place and the solution you purport to want at arm's length. An effective and heartfelt apology is completely falling on your sword. Anything else will come off as half-baked. You may as well have said, let them eat cake. Here's a suggestion. If you need to apologize for something, write it out first, and then read it over. If it contains any reasons, justifications why you acted the way you did, it simply won't work. Take away the justification and clear the way towards a solution. If you really want a solution, edit out the justification and remove the pollution. All the best, John.